Hi everyone, I'm Michelle here at my everyday wife life. I thought I would show you my outdoor space. I was inspired by amateur decorating like a pro. She did a collab uh, about a week and a half ago. So I thought I would do um, my outdoor space. This is my front porch. And this is a little bench here that I decorate periodically, change it out. I had spring stuff uh, here recently and took all that down and decided to um, do some patriotic decorating with uh, July 4th coming up. So I already had these little napkins here. Um, so I just draped them over these rustic frames I have. I put different stuff on there every time I change it out. And these little cute little um, twig deer. Um, I don't know where I got those. Had those for a while. But I just got these little jars at Walmart. I think they were $2.98 each and they had some different one, um, different, all different kinds there. So I'm going to put little tea lights in there and yeah. And then one of my little crafty projects. I took some spray, red, white, and blue spray paint and spray painted some pine cones and put them in this basket. I thought that was cute. And this little tray I got from the dollar spot. It might have been the three dollars though at Target and little flags were at Target. And then the little uh, tin can has little star cutouts. And that was from Target too. And I just put some little burlap in there to hold up the flags. And this is my lantern that I got at Old Time Pottery. It's sort of like um, Old Time Pottery. I don't know if you've heard of it. But it's sort of like um, Hobby Lobby. I don't know if it's just a local store. I'm not sure if they're a chain or not. So uh, I just put some candles in there. And that I already had. And some burlap that I already had. And these necklaces, red, white, and blue necklaces that I bought um, last year and then never used. So I just draped them in there to make it look um, patriotic, I guess. So that's the little bench on my front porch. And I'll just show you quickly the rest of my front porch. This is my door with the little um, sign that I got from... Michael's I think and just used white chalk mark on there and this is recently a sign that I made and um, I got a little crafty and made this sign with some letters and things from Michael's and I'll put the link to that below. I'm thinking of changing that out and put 4th of July on there. These are just made with, um, I mean hung on there with the, that double sided sticky tape foam thing so I think I just pop these off and put some different ones out. That was my idea to change this out periodically. And I just have a little basket here with some chalk, sidewalk chalk in for my grandnieces and nephews when they come over this I can chalk on the sidewalk. And then this is the other portion of my patio. Um, a little set here and um, I have some rustic things here. That's from I think the horse is from Hobby Lobby and I don't remember where I got those letters. I'm not really sure. Maybe it'll say on the back. Let's see. Well, they were $12.99 though. <gasps> kind of expensive. I don't remember where I got those. But those really need to be hung up on the wall more up there. But I need a special drill and drill bit and yeah I'm not good at that I need to wait for my husband to do that and this little mug here is I recently cleaned out my parents shed um they're getting rid of a lot of stuff they're kind of getting on up in age and was just looking to get rid of a bunch of stuff and I found this in there it's something I made in uh, junior high school <laughs> I thought it was cute and looked a little rustic so I thought I'd put that there a little memento and the patio looks over at my landscaping that needs is in need of dire redoing. And I ha it looks out of view over the lake. And this is a very nice porch. Sit out here, have a cup of tea, and uh, 
I think I might just do that. I hope you enjoy your day.